So this is a a a minor. This is so this is a minor scale. And if you observe, this is what, what I played when I told you that this is this was the what relative minor of C. A is the relative A is the relative minor of C, right? Or, or, did you get it now? So let me go back to let me now buttress. Let me now explain what I was teaching you again before. Now this this is key C. Let me now go back to what I was teaching you. This is key C. I want to get the relative minor of key C. Remember, relative minor key is the key that shared the same features, the same uh, key properties, the same key signature, the same um, whatever it is, the same characteristics with another key entirely. They are like brothers and sisters. The relative minor of key C. How do you get the relative minor of key C? How do you get the relative minor? It's by counting six degrees forward. Do you get? You can't, you start from that key. Like, for example, I want to get the relative minor of key C. The relative minor of key C will be what? Do C is one, D is two, E is three, F is four, G is five, A is six. So, this is the six notes. So, A, A happens to be what? The relative, what? relative minor of C. And the reason why is like that because when you're running this, the reason why A happens to be the relative minor is, is following the principle that you is six note is the six note number one. Number one principle is that it's the six note number two principle is that when you're running the scale of A minor of the this this A now, you're not going to play any black keys. Everything's going to be white, right? On C now, let's say it's on C. I just played on C during last Latido. I just played the major key of C. Now the the relative minor of the of this key C, the relative minor, not the minor, not the minor. The minor is key C minor is do re mo fa so do re mo fa so zi to do do re mo fa so zi to do 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 to zi do to zi so fa mi do to zi so fa mo re do. This is C C minor. I want to play the relative minor of this key C now. The relative minor is now you will not play A. Hope you understand. You will not play A. You will not play everything white you play the a la ti do re mi fa so la that is why that that is how this thing came about when i told you when i when i showed you from the previous classes that the natural minor of this key uh, is this one when i told you that's a i just showed you that's a the natural minor of key c is a i didn't tell you how it came about right now i'm teaching you now the natural mind the natural mind the relative minor of key c the relative minor of key C is the natural natural minor scale. Just put it like that. That is the summary. <laughs> so if you are writing, so like I always say, if you are watching the video, always have your book and pen because everything is not going to be in the writings. I'm not going to give everything in the writings. Have your book and pen because there are some things I cannot write, I cannot mention, or in the writings. Just have your book and pen if you're um, listening to the class. Be writing down your points. Now. The relative min the relative minor scale, the, sorry, the relative minor key of this is this is C. The relative minor of key C, which is A. When you run the scale of the relative minor of the keys of the key you're playing in, the, the scale becomes the the relative uh, the, uh, the natural minor scale of that keys of that key that you're playing. Hope it's not confusing. So just just put it like that. So do you, so let's do it again. So what is the relative minor of key C? You count it six upward. One, two, three, four, five. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. A. So you play A. So A now, A is now the role of relative minor of what of key C. You see it now. So let's let me show you this in another key so that you understand. Let's say this for example, is this key C sharp. This key C sharp, right? So this key C sharp. Now I want to. This key C sharp now. Hmm? This is key C sharp. So on key C sharp now, what is the relative minor of key C sharp? What will, what will be the relative minor of key C sharp? This C sharp. So what I will do, we'll follow the same principle. Let's count the six notes. The six notes. So the sixth note will be what? C sharp one, D sharp two, F is three, uh, F sharp is four, G sharp is five, and then you come to your A sharp is six. So this is the sixth note. The sixth note of is sorry the the relative minor of C sharp is A sharp. 
the six, A sharp is the sixth note now, right? We have one, two, three, four, five, six. So this is how it came about. When I showed you that now, you will not run. Sorry. Now you see that I just played la ti do re mi fa sol la la so fa mi re do ti la. That means that means you could see that this is the interwoven. They are, they are linked to each other. When I played uh, key C sharp, I played the scale, key C sharp scale. Look, listen, listen to the key C sharp scale. Do re mi fa sol la ti do. The note that are similar, I play this in key C sharp. I play E, and I play E, and I play E, and I play the E is your me, and I play T, T to be your B, right? Do re mi. Observe very closely. Do re mi fa sol la ti. E and E and what? E and um, and E and 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 B. E is your me. Why B is your what? T. Now, now watch what I will play in the relative minor. Watch what I play. The relative minor of key C sharp is what is is your A sharp. You just count it six. One, count it six upward. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, let me run it here. Do do do. Now, you, do you observe what I did? Did you observe the notes I played? The notes are linked to each other. Remember we said uh, relative minor have similar notes that are linked to each other. Now I played the same notes. I played the same T and I played some Mi. And I, remember I played it in key C sharp. Now nah, I still played it. This is... You know, I'm playing the relative minor of key C sharp now. La, ti, do, re, mi, fa, sol, la. You can have to... I played it, this, this me, this T and me is very common. I played it in, in C sharp as well. Now in C sharp is do, re, mi. Now nah, see me here. The same thing though, fa, sol, la, ti. So me and T, they are similar to each other on the relative minor of C sharp. Uh, which would bring uh, uh, to A sharp.